So I was searching through some old Game Maker files and I came across this program I made which would make a good tutorial on graphic manipulation. This is something that could be useful in many Game Maker games and it deals more with just editing the graphics than with than with the actual game code. In this game you have these bricks that fall from the top of the screen. Some of them have cracks in them and your goal as the player and WSAD, up, down, left, right, VBN, and enter, shift, control are the controls. Your job is to destroy these bricks before they reach the bottom of the screen. For every brick that reaches the bottom of the screen, the count is added up and you have to destroy more bricks to escape. Once a certain number of bricks have been destroyed, as shown in this area over here, then a finish line will appear and you touch the finish line to win the game. Let's see how it works. So as you notice, I'm shooting the brakes, but they're not being destroyed. But if I shoot this blue missile, I can turn around the brick, then shoot it again where the crack is, and the brick will successfully be destroyed. As so. Occasionally some bombs appear and you can pick up the bombs and shoot those to destroy the bricks that don't have any cracks on them. Now these are the same graphic and so I'm going to show you a little trick on manipulating the graphics so you can do a tr this kind of thing in your games. <coughs> If you look on the top here, on the sprites and under bricks, I'll open one of these bricks and you see it's just one graphic and it has the little crack there. And I've cropped and I've centered the graphic. Now what I did after that was right clicked, right clicked the brick and duplicated it. Upon duplicating it, we had the I had the entire brick here and then I went to edit sprite, double click, and I erased all the areas around the crack. All the areas that I did not want to be uh, if I shot my missile, if the missile hit any of these areas, the bricks would destroy it. So while I'm in game, I have the brick and I have the crack. And the crack is invisible but is placed over the top of the brick like a so, to where it matches. And then what happens is, as the, as the I shoot the certain missiles, the graphic is changed. It turns around the, the both graphics. Since I didn't crop around this this graphic here, it rotates in the in the correct position with the other brick. I hope that made I hope that made sense. <laughs> if not, just open it up and take a look at the graphics and what I did. You can uh, get an idea of what I did with the, uh, the brick objects under objects bricks and what happens when the red dart, the blue dart, and the different missiles hit the brick. And that's it for this tutorial.